here. Let me get out of the rippers. Well, I gotta get out of these cover, man. Without armor, this shit is kicking my ass. Shit, I'm about to die. Hi guys, uh, Fighting Red Lines here, and this is part two basically of the mining. Uh, we've got AJ, who is our encyclopedia expert on everything, so we just go to AJ whenever we need something that we don't know. <laughs> and that has just been, that's been a factor that I've known ever since I got in, because that was like the first thing Eric told me. If you ever have a question, ask me or AJ. Mainly AJ. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's unreachable. Why? Oh, he wants to smack me. He, he wants to go for oh, me, but he's stuck on you. Oh, that's what it was. Oh, shit. He only hit me once and then got bored. Not oh, prick. But yeah, so okay. when when AJ is ready, he'll explain like in more detail the, the mining. Cause... I'm going to turn my mic off so my background noise doesn't affect you guys on your video. Oh, well, yeah, yeah. Don't worry when AJ's on. Well, I don't know if AJ's ready. I guess I'm ready as much as I can be. Oh, I mean. uh, good luck there, Charlton Heston. I'll be back on in two minutes. I'm still <laughs> okay. here. I'm just like. Okay, AJ. Yeah, when whenever you're ready to like give insight on like uh, your best description on mining, we can go nuts. Uh, basically, with mining, you would want a finder that you're maxed out on. With uh, basically your average search depth, you want. Uh, like with the F105, you want 522.4 out of the 522.4 for the so you're not wasting. Um, I do Terra recommend. Master. I do use TerraMaster a lot uh, compared to F105, but I would recommend uh, getting the little big mining log before you actually do start mining. Uh, so you can keep track of your uh, claims. Uh, for example, on the surface, all you gotta do is uh, find where the vein is going, and you can just get almost close to a 90% claim rate. How do you get a and mining also, log? Uh, you can download it oh, okay. uh, from a little big mining log. Uh, true, it's a little kind of a pain to get it all set up, but once you do, it, it is beneficial. And it is uh, supported by mine, or it does have permission by mine art to be used. Okay, so uh, yeah, it is a legal thing, which is good. And then, uh, like in the underground, you can track uh, where you got right, hit. Hey. And like, uh, and then you can actually look on the mining log to see where you got your big claims and you can go back and hit those up once in a while yeah so you know where you've like say you got a half while you were mining you'd be able to go straight back to it like you took me onto that pvp zone didn't you yeah exactly like that where i went to the same exact spot and i ended up globaling again yeah okay so yeah, um, just to recap, um, what would your uh, what would you say is the the best mining tool so far for you, at, like at the level you are? For me personally, I like using a TerraMaster Five. Mm -hmm. However, uh, uh, I do sometimes resort to my F one hundred five in between, uh, just because it gets the uh, lower claims more than what the Terra Master 5 does. Okay, yeah. And, um, you said... Hey, hey Mark, let, let them know about the, um, using the three options for mining instead of going with two or one. You know, for energy, matter, treasure, and the other one, you know. Well, if you're on Arcadia, Arcadia has the treasure option. Which costs 30 probes instead of the energy and ore. Uh, ore does the 20, energy does the 10. Uh, you can drop all three, but uh, it's a good chance you'd come out negative doing it that way. So, what would you recommend like um, to use? What would you use the most, and what wouldn't you use out of those three? 
Like what what should they prioritize as like a like say as a noob, what should they prioritize? Uh depending on what planet they're on. Uh like if they're on Cali, you don't even get the option for treasure. Yeah. Uh a lot of people do the ore just because it has a higher payout for the most part. Uh, some people do the energy just because it's not mined as much. Hmm. Uh, so they they sometimes get better hits for bigger claims. Okay, yeah. But so it's kind of yeah. I understand, I understand that concept. Um, what would you recommend on Arcadia? Because this is obviously on Arcadia right now, so. Uh, on an Arcadia, like, a, uh, what I do to kind of, uh, to where, like, if I'm on the surface and I'm trying to find a vein, I usually just stick with energy because it costs less, and then once I find the vein, I can move up and do energy and ore, and then occasionally I'll drop all three if I get, uh, I'm just going to drop all three just to see what's here. Mm. Because sometimes you do get all three in a single radius. Yeah, yeah. Um, and because um, on part one, me and Eric were talking about treasure. And we didn't really know. Well, we gave a rough idea, but we didn't really know where the best place were to do treasure. Because uh, obviously it is three probes just to drop it. So it's more expensive. But So we wanted like an, a rough idea. What would you recommend? Like in the water or shit like that? Uh, treasure, it's kind of mix and match. Um, I do find more in, like on Arcadia in the desert uh, part of the map. I do find a, uh, quite a bit of treasure down there. And also in the underground, I usually find a lot uh, by the Oratans. Yeah. Okay. Because, no, because it's like... Um, in the last video, I just grabbed the the basic TT gear and went on a uh, on a mining trip, and um, I struck uh, I think it was twice or three times out of like the four or five times that I used it. So I did rough, I, I broke even. I think actually I got more back, but obviously I know that that isn't the the concept all the time. It was. Um, because like yours goes a lot lot deeper so as it as eric said like eric will go somewhere where no one ever minds really like on top of a mountain and obviously because yours can do a lot lot more depth i think that would be a better place for you because you can probe deeper than what i can uh yeah i can draw like if i had my terra master 5 and you had a f105 i could drop in the same spot you did and get one however like going just randomly going to a, a top of a mountain just because you, you think no one's gonna be there it all it all depends where the vein is actually going like yeah. on the surface uh, if it's not going that way you can mine there all day and not get anything but i mean you can get off the side of the mountain where the vein is and strike every single time yeah. it's not where everybody is mining it's where the vein is actually going okay but why is that like a separate system like why haven't they put it in in entropia like the the vein finder uh, like, like they could put it as a skill you get what i mean Because all, all a little big mining log is doing is reading what uh, the game produces. Okay. So, I don't know if that would, since the information would be stored on the, like, little big mining is stored on my computer, instead of having everybody stored on the server itself. Uh, that's probably why it's not an in-game. Yeah, okay. Well, that's actually a good concept. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Well, that's actually that helped a lot more than like what we did, because <laughs> we sort of like we talked more about the the whole concept of mining. So like um like what's cheap and what's not, and what you should should do and what you shouldn't do, and 
things like that but then you put you've put more insight into it and it's has made it a lot better but um would you recommend mining uh, for a noob who doesn't want to deposit? For a noob that doesn't want to deposit, mm -hmm. uh, it would be kind of hard to get started. I would definitely just do like energy or or I would not really consider treasure as yeah. a beginner. just to save ped because otherwise you'll just be spending more on what you're earning because you haven't got the depth yeah but I uh, I mean I've heard the stories where people you know hopped out using a TT1 but in my experience I never did until I got actually learned more about it yeah but, so it's basically um, you probably end up losing ped at the beginning or if you're the lucky few, uh, might actually make a big profit. I wouldn't expect a big profit or like probably end up breaking even just starting out. Hmm. Unless you're one of those lucky few. Yeah. But, all right then. Yeah, well, cheers, AJ. That really did help quite a lot to be fair. And yeah it's uh, i can i can use that and i think everyone online will appreciate what like what you've said and everything and i think hopefully it will help them out as well to grasp the concept of mining because it's more of like a vague concept like the mining skill people come in do it and then fail miserably at it they can like i have literally seen online people mine for seven hours straight and literally not get a single claim Yeah, I can, especially like if you go to the underground or Boma or Monteria, the places that have the the indoor rules uh, that cut your radius in half, uh, those you can easily uh, lose pet on, yeah. unless you kind of uh, know what you're looking for. I don't know what to make of Eric's comment. Is it? <laughs> I'm just like, is it? Is it? He's being serious, or is he being naughty again? <laughs> Obviously, I mean, it sounded like a good episode from fucking uh, Maury Povich, so I figured I'd lighten it up a little bit. <laughs> no, but I, I admit. AJ brought up really good like topics to talk about and talking about his little big minor thing that will help people a lot you gotta rub your rocks man if you need yeah. bigger drops rub your rocks that's it <laughs> yeah they'll drop then <laughs> won't they <laughs> hey look dude I gotta go to the Huans man cause they're dropping alright <laughs> like my rocks you coming? yeah I'll come but I'm going to end the, the episode here because... Then... Oh, no, no, go ahead. Finish I'll, I'll turn yeah. my mic off so I don't disturb your, your broadcast so people don't think I'm insane. <laughs> no, don't worry. Okay, guys, uh, I'm going to end the, the video here. Uh, thank you for AJ and Eric for coming and helping me out for the past couple of videos, especially AJ for this one. Uh, he put a lot of insight in the things that I didn't understand, that Eric didn't understand, and uh, that we didn't even know about because we vaguely went over his little big mining uh, program thingy uh, we didn't know if it was allowed or not or anything like that but AJ's cleared that up so thank you AJ and thank you Eric um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video um, if you have any comments leave it down below I reply as quickly as I can with a comment or a video thank you guys so much for watching I'll catch you in the next video I love you all bye bye